Hello and welcome everyone to my channel. My name is Catherine Belair and I wear many, many uh, hats. I am a sewing professional. I am a medicine woman in alternative medicines. I have uh, different certificates in nutrition and energy healing and completing another one in healing environment and body, mind and spirit and soul. And uh, today, I know there's uh, lots of people out there are afraid of uh, this coronavirus. And I have uh, some good news for you so that you can have a peace of mind and that you can relax. Okay, did you know that diseases of any kind do not live in an alkaline body? Okay, the, there is um, several great ways to alkaline the body. First of all is uh, fresh lemons. Fresh lemons uh, help to detox the liver and it also helps to uh, alkaline your body pretty, pretty fast. Uh, you just need half of a lemon per day. It, it, it has all the vitamin C intake in, uh, in fresh lemon. So what I recommend to you you to do have um, half a lemon if you can um, and, and juice it uh, a, a lemon and, and drink some lemon juice a fresh lemon juice every day and you can add a little bit of honey in it if you like and, and another thing is apple cider vinegar add one teaspoon of this in a cup of water and drink it have one one cup of the uh, um, one, one cup of that a, Per day that will help you to alkaline your body it's also good for pets um, apple cider vinegar so what you do um, take about oh I would say uh, one two three tablespoon of the diluted uh, already diluted from your cup uh, and, and put it mix it with your um, the pet food that you uh, give it uh, and make sure that you uh, mix it very very well and um, and uh, oh, ginger, ginger. Uh, make yourself some tea in it. You can also a uh, great combination is um, when you put your uh, lemon, half a lemon or a lemon. You can put the lemon peel in it too. With when you ground your your lemon, uh, lemon peel um, helps with varicose vein. Anyways, you can add um, ginger and also lemon. Those are very nice combination. Um, it's really nice and healing. So that will really help to uh, boost your immune system. And uh, ginger, the nice thing about ginger, it helps to clean your intestines and help with the digestive system. It's really awesome. All the uh, organs here. And, and you want that. It's, uh, it makes your, your body and organ very strong and healthy. So, and another thing too, onions. You want onions. Onions help to fight disease. And garlic, garlic. Carrots and potatoes. Potatoes are, are really awesome for stress because right now, lots of you are stressed out and feeling afraid. When you feel afraid and stressed, make yourself some potatoes and, and stay away from fried stuff like you know potato chips and stuff like that you want healthy you want to eat your food healthy you know steam your potatoes uh, it, it's the best way or in the oven um, you can eat it with a peel or peel it it doesn't matter um, it, it uh, potatoes have all the nutrient almost all the nutrient that your body needs the only thing you need to add is uh, add some protein with it and uh, some uh, calcium and, and you can get that in almond milk um, another thing that is great to boost your immune system is coconut fresh coconut coconut oil and coconut milk it's good to ma make mashed potatoes and add the coconut milk. I love that. I do that all the time. And, and um, sweet potatoes is good too. And um, sage, sage tea. You might want to make yourself some sage tea every day. Sage tea is known among the uh, herb doctors to be the... Uh, the best healer it heals just about any disease 
sage is one of the sacred herb among the Native American. And it's known to, uh, to uh, help the body, mind, and spirit. It helps to heal the body, it helps to calm the, the mind down, and it, it's uh, good for spiritual warfare as well. Some people like to do smudging as well. It's also um, some scientists' research has um, discovered that if we burn some sage, it, it kind of kills the uh, something in the air, the, the, the disease in the air. So anyways, and, and um, I want to show you my uh, beautiful aloe vera plant. Aloe vera plant is not just for healing sunburn. Aloe vera plant is edible. There's all kinds of aloe plants. You want the aloe vera plant. And I made some videos on the aloe vera plant. You want to take the poison out, the yellow stuff that is inside the plant. I, I, I made several videos on showing you how to take the poison out. So look at those videos. And aloe vera plant is really awesome to boost the immune system. The aloe vera plant is known as a miracle plant. It, uh, it knows the difference between healthy cells and unhealthy cells. And aloe vera plant kills the unhealthy cells. Any growth that you would have into your body, it would kill, kill it. Um, cancer and leukemia, it, it helps to stop the spread of HIV, it helps uh, polyps, uh, fibroids, uh, name it. Uh, it. It's really awesome to uh, boost your immune system. And, and a way that I, I like to consume my aloe vera plant, uh, I, I put it, um, you know, I, uh, it's the gel inside that you want. And I juice it, uh, I juice it with something else like banana or fruits. And you can even, a, a great combination is to mix that with a lemon, fresh lemon and ginger and honey. It's a really uh, proven fact of a really strong medicine. And um, it's, um, you can look at in the description below. I do have uh, lots of stuff there for you um, in case if I forgot to say something or whatever I said, uh, it will be down there. And, and I will be making other videos too. And uh, what else? To um, meditate. You want to meditate. Learn to relax. Because uh, fear and panicking doesn't work in your favor. It, it will uh, only aggravate things. You want to relax, uh, meditate, uh, take some nice deep breath in and out. You know, take, even if it's just five minutes a day, it it it, it helps. And and uh, remember to enjoy life to the fullest. Do fun things. Do. Do what you love more often. Well, when you're having fun and play, you heal fast. And, and you also stay healthy as well. And pray. And, uh, and I'm not talking about religion. Religion is just man-made to control people. You know, take the, the positive out religion, but leave the, the hate part out of it. But pray to your high power. Um, you know, uh, express your feelings that you have and ask your high power to protect you and heal you and, and, and talk from your heart. And uh, what else can I say? Oh, eat leafy green vegetables. Um, and uh, try to eat it raw as you can and like eating raw carrots. And, and what I like to do, um, I like to chop onions. And what I like to do, I, I chop it very finely and I swallow um, a spoonful of it. You know, just like taking vitamins. And I do the same thing with garlic too, like raw. Because what it does, it, um, it, it really uh, reinforces your immune system and kills... Whatever that needs to kill, if there is something to kill in your, your body. And if not, it just makes your body stronger and healthier. And I'm just looking in my paper here. Oh, I'm sure. Oh, you want vitamin C. Uh, lots of vitamin C. Like, you know, cranberries, a sign vitamin C. Lemon. Just half of a lemon. There's 
uh, all the vitamin C and taken there and um, and there's lots of stuff that you can uh, take um, uh, chicken broth with garlic or onions it's a nice combination and, and you want to get your sleep full sleep and rest because when we're tired we're prone to get sick you know or do some mistake and if you have a hard time to sleep sage tea before bedtime will help you to give you a peace of mind and sleep and so as peppermint tea peppermint tea will it helps to calm the nerves and help with insomnia and help you to have a good night's sleep and it also help with gas and and uh, fungus and uh, athlete foot and uh, all that kind of stuff uh, many many more so I will be making other videos on coronavirus just to uh, you know add some peace of mind to people and and, and count your blessing have a journal it, write down all the positive things try to focus on the positive things uh, in words words have power P uh, words can heal someone or it can cut like a sword words can heal or make you sick look up Dr. Emoto and his watcher experiment on YouTube uh, uh, Dr. Emoto, I, I really admire Dr. Emoto. He he proves um, how uh, words um, has an uh, impact on ourselves and on other people in our environment. And whatever we put out there, the words we speak, it comes back to us. So try to use your words to build yourself up. It's worth it. And, and even though if you're not perfect, that's okay. Forgive yourself. Uh, don't beat yourself up. No one is perfect. Just, just do your best. That's all that matters. And uh, EFT, EFT work um, helped me out so much. And I do EFT with Brad, Brad Yates on YouTube. I've been tapping to his free videos on YouTube, and he helped me so much at turning things around. He helped with creating happiness, health, and wealth in your life. He even has a, a videos on coronavirus boosting your immune system. Uh, I would encourage you to uh, tap to that and and um, and stay away from unhealthy food, you know, like junk food and processed food and fried food. Uh, eat those things just as a treat, not as an everyday food. Eat nutritious, you know, like onions and garlic and and carrots you know juice your carrots you know uh, fast if you can like once a day if you can I mean not once a day but once a week or once a month or or fasting eating lightly like eating carrots and and leafy green vegetables and garlic you know uh, anyways um, I want to say thank you to all of you for watching the video and and uh, my prayers goes to you and all my positive uh, healing energy is uh, going all to you. Thumb up this video if you like it. Share this video if um, you know to help uh, others to have a peace of mind and to give empowerment to others and and um, subscribe to my channel so like that you'll get. Um, in touch with my new videos coming out and I'll have other videos to help you out with uh, the you know coronavirus and wishing everyone bright blessings